Hey guys, Little Mao here. We're going to the city today, so today's vlog is going to be very, very exciting. Uh, I'm going to miss the family, obviously, but we have a new chapter ahead of us for New York City, so I'm excited to see what today will bring us. We'll get there at 12.30, so we can definitely have some fun in New York City today as well. So today is going to be awesome. I found my new mic for my camera that I lost like a year ago, but now I found it, so that way the audio quality on our videos will be much higher. So let's see the difference in the next clip. Here we are at the bus station, me and Matt. Yep. Getting ready to go to the city. Got our family there, dad, mom, dog, Spikey. Getting ready to go. Although it's a little late with the buses. Matt. What? This kid gotta go to school in the bus late. <laughs> he even got his book back. Friend today, Matt. Hey. What? What? He's gonna do a friend today. Nothing. You say bang. <laughs> Baby. About 10 minute late, so hopefully there's no layover delays or issues. But uh, we only got a half an hour to get from the other bus, so hopefully we got enough time. There we are. All right, Matt. Yep. See you later, bud. Yep. See you, bro. See you, Matt. We're gonna miss you, though. Really. Yeah, I'm gonna miss you too. Dad. Okay. See you later, Matt. See you later. <laughs> Bye, mom. Gonna miss you. Miss you. All right, Matt. Yep. See ya. Right. All right. See you later. Everyone, come in for a picture. Well, a video thing. Right. I'll take a screenshot. So we're here on the bus. Quite a bit of people already. Probably got stuck up in the border. But we're headed to the city now. We got Wi Fi so we can listen to music. And we're on our way. So we're supposed to be in Albany at 9.15, but it's like 9.05 right now. And I don't know where the hell we are, but it's not Albany. But they took the freaking routes instead of the highway, so I don't know what's up. So I'll probably be in the city a little bit later than expected. But I don't know. You know, that's just crazy. Well, why are you taking routes instead of the highway? I don't know, but we're gonna get there either way, so no tripping. Here are the Golden Gate Bridge. This is what's on the front. Golden Gate Bridge. San Francisco, here we go. Alrighty, so we made it to uh, the Albany bus on time and we're almost there. And they only let us have one bag, but I have three, so now I guess I have to sit with it for a year. The ride. It's almost halfway there and everyone's like pretty much sleeping. We're gonna be there in like two hours. Hit it, we're here, Port Authority, just waiting for our friend. And we're gonna be headed to Brooklyn. So awesome, we made it. Got a lot of stuff. You know, so at least we're here. Sorry I wasn't able to show you before, but we're gonna be able to show you now. I was getting situated in, but I'm gonna go show you the Hudson. It looks beautiful from here. You can see Manhattan. Uh, the view is just a short walk away, so let's go. And here at the pier, you got the beautiful sunset of Manhattan. You got the bridge right there, and then you got Manhattan. So it's really, really beautiful. We'll go show you more around. Here we are, here is the skyline, Manhattan, and you also have the bridge somewhere over there. I can't really see, it's kind of bright, but yeah, this view, five minute walk, that's awesome. And from here, the background, you can see the ferries taking off, they can go to Manhattan, it's really, really nice. And over here, we got these huge, huge buildings, 
and those are like uh, apartments and such like that. That's really really nice over there. It's like three to five thousand dollars a month, which is crazy crazy crazy. And over here we have Manhattan, and I think you can see the Empire State Building in the background. The sun's in my eyes, so I can't really check the viewfinder, but yeah. I'm gonna head to the grocery store. If you walk the other way to the street that we got here, we can go to the grocery store. So it's really nice that I'm in between both the grocery store and this nice, beautiful scene. But we're gonna go try to get some floss since the other grocery store didn't have floss, which I think is a little odd. But you know, they only had one toothbrush, one, uh, you know, toothpaste. It's definitely very, very different. Everything's very small and compact here. So it does kind of remind me of work since we had a small and compact store. But, uh, you know, you can't even fit really a cart down the aisle. It's pretty crazy. So, we'll go ahead and let's see it. Prices don't seem too bad here. No, same about the same as home. All right, we found our cloth here. 219, it's quite a bit more than home. Uh, you know, at least this section has a decent dental section. I got this cut here because Drew hit me with his gauntlet. And you wouldn't think gauntlets would be you know, razor sharp, but they're pretty damn sharp. And so noisy here in New York City. Very, very noisy, but a lot of stuff's going on and it's gonna be a lot of fun. So we're here at the park. I remember when I used to skateboard here and there's people skateboarding now. I don't even know if you can hear from the audio because it's quite loud here. You got the road, traffic's really picking up. We're going deep and fast. But uh, we're going to go on the bridge and just get a nice view of the Hudson River and, you know, just have some fun. It's the architecture. And look at the architecture of that building. That is really nice. Definitely got to get a bike or a skateboard. I wanted to bring my skateboard, but there wasn't enough room with all my luggage. So, but definitely got to get a bike or a skateboard here to travel around. And we got people over here playing drums, as you can see, right there, should be able to see. And you know, this is just really, really nice. It's relaxing, there's a lot of noise, a lot of stuff going on in the city, but you know, if this is what you like, and if you want to get a job in my field, this is really the place to be, so. Hopefully everything will come out well, and I'll find a job, a career soon, and it'll be great. So. I'm loving it. The inside of the bridge, and there's a lot of runners here actually. But uh, I can't wait to see this view because it is going to be awesome. Because of the cars here, it shakes quite a bit. I'm actually surprised, you know. It's a big steel structure, but it's got some good shake to it. It isn't as quite good because the bridge is just so large that you have like these bars so that way no one can commit suicide off here. So you can't really get a whole lot of view, but. As you can see, it looks pretty good. It is shaking quite a bit, even up here from the freaking cars. Cool. Like, how did people get there to spray paint? That's pretty crazy. I wouldn't want to be up there. Okay, so now I remember where we are exactly. Uh, so I remember this place quite well. But one thing I would not like right now is the traffic. Gonna walk around Manhattan for a little bit before we head back. Check out maybe some of the stores or something, but definitely Manhattan is more lively. <laughs> maybe just because everyone's like outside. Maybe it's because it's night, you know? Found yeah. my favorite place, the uh, Asian supermarket. We're gonna have to go check this out. We have to come in and actually look around. Prices don't seem too, too bad. Uh, had a uh, shrimp really cheap there, $5.99 a pound. That's cheap for upstate even. Uh, but that'd be cool to get some shrimp one of these days. But it is definitely very different than the Asian Mart in like, let's say, Albany. Those ones are a bit different. They have a lot more uh, stuff in them. But just going around and seeing what they got. I think that's the farthest we'll walk today. We'll head back on the bridge. It's getting kind of late, and you know, I want to get some dinner. 
maybe we'll vlog that. But it's been a wonderful experience so far. We'll go down that side of the street, see the difference. One of the things I've already noticed that's pretty uh, different is how the older people still dress up in nicer clothes. They try to, you know, stay with the current fashion trends and stuff like that. It's very different from upstate where, you know, they clearly dress differently, the age distinction. But uh, I guess everyone's just out here to impress, you know. I guess it's, uh, you know, big impress state. Who's got more money, who's got more of this, you know, so. But uh, I guess you gotta get used to it. It really is the city that never sleeps. I bet there'd be people walking on this at like 3, 4 in the morning. So yeah, people gotta get out from the night shift. Nice traffic. What I like about is the buildings. They all look awesome at night. The lights, it's very, very beautiful. Yeah, full moon out. Oh man, very, very nice. And we are back, and if you can see behind us, that red thing in the Empire State Building. Just gonna show you the view again at night and show you just how beautiful it is at night. And I like it better at night with all the lights. Well, we'll go down the pier more and show you more of the skyline. Right, well, I hope you liked our vlog of me moving to New York City. And I hope you will comment, rate, subscribe, and comment below. I reply to every single comment. So tell me how I can improve and make better vlogs. And let me know what kind of content you want me to produce for you as well. Thank you so much for watching this episode of The Chief Vlogs. Thank you.